parents, guests, kids sitting in who aren't really in the league, etc. My name is Colin O'Donnell, and today I will be talking to you about Mad Libs. What are Mad Libs, some of you might ask? That's a great question. Mad Libs are basically the ideal game for the car if you're more of the license plate game. They're known as a crazy fill-in-the-blank game with a lot of random silly results. And it's amazingly weird what can happen. Seriously, who's ever heard of purple french fries? <laughs> a little bit of history of Mad Lib. This may sound a little weird to you. A man called Leonard Stern accidentally created Mad Libs with his friend Roger Price. <laughs> Stern was sitting at his desk, suffering the writer's block, when he asked Price for an adjective. Price came back with the word clumsy and naked. <laughs> Turns out Stern was trying to describe somebody's boss's nose. <laughs> <laughs> so then they began to create Mad Libs, but they could not come up with a catchy title. So one morning in a coffee shop, Stern overheard somebody saying that they were going to ad lib a commercial. That guy's companion said that it was Matt. Light bulb. <laughs> So then that created Mad Libs. After bouncing back and forth between in game publisher and book publisher, boom, 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 kind of like a pinball game, and they finally decided to create it, them, to publish it themselves. Now a little more on the speech term ad lib. It's another term for improvise or to make up something that you forgot. For example, well, a guy called Martin played Hamlet in a play. But he forgot his famous line, to be or not to be. So instead he says, I am what I am. <laughs> <laughs> As you all know, Mad Libs are unexpected and surprisingly hilarious. Now, <coughs> let's tackle this next challenge together. But first, I'll need a volunteer. <laughs> Run. Run right here. <coughs> Are you. Uh, Alright, let's see. 
Oh yeah, another verb. Roll. Roll. Alright, I need a number. 1,082. 1,082. And finally, an adjective. An adjective.